Yes, sir. It's your boy B Hayes. We back with another one, guys. So the end of the stock market correction is near, in my opinion, guys. Like I've been telling you guys in previous videos, I don't believe the market is going too much lower, and that's including AMC, mean stocks as well, guys. But the whole market as one big whole has been trending in a downward trend for a while now. And like I told you guys, bear markets tends to last between eight to nine months and a bull market can last between three to four years, guys. So the market is usually in the green way more often times than it is in the red. And I believe we is about to have this huge turnaround and a lot of, you know, stocks is about to start sending off again. We knew the market has, you know, been in a, in a weird spot for the ones that understand and get it, get it. For the ones that don't, it'll take time, but you will eventually start to understand how the algorithms of the market can change different, you know, they just try to change the whole situation, the whole algorithm of the markets and make it more confusing and make you adapt. That's why adaptation is a must within the markets. You got to know how to do adapt and, you know, learn the new flow of the market, the new wave, however you want to put it and adapt uh to your current situation so what i mean by that is you know most of the time the markets whenever we was before we got into the state that we're in now it usually be a sectors like sectors that go off on um, the energy sector or go off or the ev sector go off or the marijuana sector go off or the you know it'll be different uh areas of the market that be hot while the other ones are not guys so right now We've been in a state recently where everything is going in the same direction. Everything's pulling back in the red at the same time. Everything's going up in the green at the same time, whenever it does. And the only reason we've been seeing that little bit of green recently in the past, it ain't much, not really any recovery of a green, but it's, you know, putting us in the green a bit. Only reason they do that is because they can't justify the market and bring it down any lower so they'll let it run a little bit just to take it back to where it previously was keep doing that a few times to try to get the majority the people that's less educated out of the market take their shares so they could buy it buy them and load up at the cheaper price and ride the markets right back up guys like i told you guys small mid and large cap stocks has been hit very very hard i'm talking 30 40 some even 70 percent it's not much lower that they're going to go in my opinion the market is due for a turnaround also something that caught my attention on today we is seeing a difference a different uh type of vibe in the market that i haven't seen recently and this is giving me an indication that you know the market is trying to calibrate and get back into uh, a vibe and what i mean by that is if you notice you see energy the energy sectors are going off today everything's in the red but energy uh but the energy sector you got like stocks like ticker symbol cei going off up over 25 percent on today you got ticker symbol indo up over 100 plus percent on today so you got stocks like this a penny stock you know up and what i know indo helped push the energy sector up like i told you guys it always be that one king that helped bring the other ones up but you got this going off 100 plus percent in a day when i know you know it don't have the same characteristics lined up as uh amc does amc should be the one popping off 100 plus percent on today but you got things like that doing it guys you get what i'm saying so it's a lot of bs a lot of fucker going on in the markets but like i say once we get up out of this hell hole the market will have some sense of direction and you actually have a sense of what's going on right now i feel like the market is all scrambled up that's why i tell you this is a time to sit on the sidelines let your bread you know let your bread sit in the cash position because having your bread sit on the sidelines is a position as well waiting on the best opportunities you don't always have to have your money in the markets sometimes the best time is to back away from the markets uh, watch see exactly what's going on and learn how to adapt to what's going on guys in the market so we're looking like we're about to go back you know to 
a diversified market, meaning not everything simultaneously coming down at the same time or simultaneously going up at the same time, but we got different sectors and different areas of the markets that's doing well and some that's doing poor. So once we get back in that state, then we'll start seeing a huge recovery within the markets, guys. So that's all I got for this video. Just want to give you guys a quick update on the market as a whole. I love you. You already know what to do. We gone and God bless you. We gone.